All right, come on in, hit the like button, think about subscribing for free. If you're new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is my personal opinion slash review uh, for the 2023 history-based thriller film called Oppenheimer, based on Oppenheimer. Uh, loosely, obviously. Um, during World War II, Lieutenant General Leslie Groves Jr. appoints physicist J. Robert Oppenheimer to work on the top secret Manhattan Project. Oppenheimer and the team of scientists spend years developing and designing the atomic bomb. Now here is some of the cast, and there is a big cast to this. This definitely has a stacked cast, as I said. There was some actors I was even surprised about seeing this. Everyone did such a fantastic job, especially Robbie Downey Jr., surprisingly, and Cillian Murphy that stood out. To be honest, most of the cast stood out a lot, but they had much bigger roles. Now, I was definitely sucked in for the most of the film, but did get a little boring around the two hour mark. However, part of the story with the telling of the storylines got a little confusing at times. Storylines specifically was blending together and making it confusing of where they fit, but it comes clear at the end. For me personally, I liked the first hour. Second hour had good spots and some math parts. Uh, and the third part, I loved the writing and the f uh, performances that were in there. Um, yeah, so... Here is my right now come back with my fall thoughts. I definitely recommend this film. However, I do feel very disappointed with Christopher Nolan that the photos of the Japan, Japan aftermath wasn't shown. They reacted to them, but they didn't show them, and I kind of just kind of fucking kind of personal and political in it. I definitely kind of felt like that was a little bit disrespectful. And also just for a historic fact of how horrible the sickening of the, the aftermath was uh, and what uh, Anouk does, it kind of had, uh, he should have done it. Um, especially with how they went around the feel of how they edited stuff around Oppenheimer and just also giving that feel from beginning to end more and more and more of how uh, remorse he was and and that regret and um, you know just making you really feel this kind of nauseous by the end of the film for me personally at least um, but I'm pretty sure you could tell that was going what uh, Christopher Nolan was going for um, but uh, yeah what are your guys thoughts leave them down below let me know um, that is all I got for you today and sorry it took a little too long to get to it today I just had other stuff to do so um, but there will be another film out uh, hopefully Saturday. Um, we'll see. Um, but uh, remember, I love you all. Please stay safe. Spread the love, most importantly. Skull.